So over here you can see that I have this file right here and it is automatically backed up. That is because with OneDrive desktop, I have set up so that the files in my desktop get automatically backed up in the cloud. If I were to go around and right click and click on new and then select out, let's say a Microsoft Word document, then what happens is that this starts getting synced out as well onto my OneDrive. And I can access out all of these on my OneDrive, whether I'm using the web version or the desktop version. So if I were to go around over here onto my Explorer, over here on the uh, OneDrive right here, you can see under the desktop, you can see all of the files right here. This is backed up on my OneDrive right here. If you want to change out the sync settings for OneDrive, then you can go around over here onto uh, the task area right here, and then you can click on the gear icon, and then go to settings as you can see right here. Once you go around over here, you can see that the uh, you, you directly get to the sync and backup option. And over here, there's different sync options that you can change. For example, there's backup important PC folders to OneDrive option, which allows you to click on manage backup and then choose the folders that you want to backup automatically to OneDrive. In my case, you can see that I have my desktop turned on and that is exactly why this is being synced out. If you don't sync it out right here, just like this, then you can continue backing up this folder right here, just like this, or, or just go around and close it and say this computer only, then the backing up of desktop is turned off right here. And you can see that the files for the desktop will be deleted in OneDrive as you select it out. And you don't see those icons for syncing anymore. But if I were to turn it up again and click on save changes right here, then you can go around and view the progress of the backup as well. And you can see that they get stuck to get backed up once more. Apart from that, if you have any photos or videos saved out on your device, then you can tend to back them out from over here as well, or don't turn it out. And here you can see that save screenshot and capture to OneDrive is option as well. For example, if you were to go around, take a screenshot right here, then what happens is that they will be backed out as well. But if you want to turn it off, then you can turn it off anytime. Over here, you also have an option to pause syncing on a metered network. So if you're using a metered network with charges um, uh, per volume basis, then it'll pause it out over there. Or you can go around over here uh, as well and then limit out the download rate so that um, uh, OneDrive only uses, let's say, for example, 100 kilobytes per second or 1000 kilobytes per second right here. You can similarly limit out the upload speed over here as well or adjust it automatically so that it does not actually hamper your surfing of the web as you uh, just work around with the file. So this is what you have as you can see and you can turn these off or on uh, uh, on your will right here. Uh, so this is what you have as you can see just like this while you're syncing out uh, uh, your, your files using OneDrive. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.